What is up guys and welcome back to another video on the channel A&R, you know, my name is Darren and today we are on NBA 2K18 and we're going to be doing a 2011-2012 OKC Thunder rebuild. So in 2011 and 2012 they had a really good team, or what they had a team that could have been really good, right? They had Kevin Durant, Russell Westbrook, and James Harden, right when James Harden was still kind of not good, he was in like his second or third year. Um, he wasn't a starter, he was a six man, he won six man of the year um, while he was with them. I'm just going to take off recently signed restrictions, and you guys know I like to take off injuries. But Russell Westbrook, he was also new. Let's go find them really quick. Where are they at? Okay, so we're going to keep the regular Thunder into uh, the old logo right there. So advance. They had the uh, young Russell Westbrook, young Kevin Durant, and really young James Harden, right? They had a few other people. I think they had Sergi Baca still. Um, their center. I'm not really sure who their center was, but let's just go ahead and look at the roster right here. So 96 Durant. He's only 24, 23 and 23 year old Russ Book and Harden, uh, Ibaka, Cephalosha, their center was Cole Aldridge, um, Monte Ellis, a really old, not too good Monte Ellis, Nick Collison, Derek Fisher, 38 years old, Reggie Jackson, before he was before he was Reggie Jackson, Michael Davis, all these people don't really know who these people are. Oh, those are all fill-ins, right? So we're going to do making a few trades, but what I want to do is I want to keep the starting three. I want to keep these three here because that's what this video is normally about. It's to see if these people, if they stay together and their team just improved a little bit, would they still be able to win a championship? Ibaka's 86 overall. He's going to leave. Sorry for anyone who loves him, but let's go to the trade finder and make a few trades. All right, here we go, guys. The first trade, we're going to be picking up Hassan Whiteside and Justice Winslow. We are going to be giving up our two best first-round picks, but Justice Winslow will be a good trading piece. He's, he's like trading a better first-round pick or something like that. But I just really wanted something above an 86 overall for our team. Now, all we really need left is a power forward. If we get a really good, like, above an 80 overall power forward, I'll be good with that. We're going to trade Justice Winslow and a pick. But I don't, know, I don't know. We'll see what we can find. What I want is a power forward. If we have to, we can always get a center and make the center a power forward and his overall might drop a few but we're gonna go make that trade here we go guys we have a pretty good trade here we have Dario Saric and Robert Covington for our team we're gonna be giving up Justin Winslow and a Reggie Jackson we're gonna get two 78s back just for giving up a 76 72 we are giving up that draft pick but we really don't need it since it's only a one-year rebuild so we can go ahead and do that trade and look at the roster now I'm thinking it's pretty good I mean we've gained what three people on our team and it's already looking a lot better so let's see if we can make, maybe make our bench a little bit better we didn't get that 80 overall power forward, but Darius Arik is, is definitely good enough. Uh, he's going to score a lot of points, a lot of stuff like that. Uh, Covington is really good. I like Ellis. Maybe we just keep Ellis. And we only need a 9-man rotation, so maybe we just trade for two more people, maybe like 75, 76 overalls, and we'll be good there. Even though I really wanted to pick up a point guard with this pick, or with this trade, I decided we're going to have to go for the overall, because there was no overalls that are 74, 75 point guards I could get with our picks. All we have is second round picks left, and Nick Collison is our best player to trade. So we're going to go ahead and do Willie Reedy, 74 overall, and Wesley Johnson. Just round out our team. They're probably not even going to get that many points. We don't need them that much, uh, just because our top three players are going to be getting all the points. So we're going to re redo the rotation. So we have 36 minutes, 34, uh, Harden, Durant, Saric, Whiteside. So that's the starting five. They're going to have the bulk of our minutes. So we really need to, to stand out because our bench is not its not too great. We have Covington, Zubak, Ellis, Willie Reed, and that's pretty much it. Derek Fisher, I guess. But he's not even in rotation. We're doing a 10-man rotation. I'm um, thinking that we're going to go to a 10 or to a 9-man rotation or a 10-man rotation just for the season so our players don't get too tired and in the playoffs we can go to a 9 or 8 man rotation whatever is needed in the playoffs to just to win games Derek Fisher if you can win score 2 points a game I'll be I'll be happy with you so we're going to go to this regular season sim to the end of the season and hopefully we we did really good I don't know um what should our record be we have to get make a guess right now what you think our final record would be I'm going to say over 55 wins so that's, that's probably going to be like top five in the league. Over 55 wins. If we can do that, there's no way we there's no way that we can't have a chance of winning the championship. So I'm simming the end of the season, and I'll see you guys there. Here we are, guys. At the end of the season, Russell Westbrook is going to win MVP, almost getting a triple-double. He needed .5 more assists to get that. Uh, let's go to Lonzo Ball, Rookie of the Year. Jeremy Lin, Sixth Man. Serge Ibaka. We traded him, but he won def Defensive Player of the Year. What did he have? He had three blocks a game and one steal. That's amazing. 
Jerry and Grant must improve. That's really weird. Billy Donovan, 69 and 13. That is the the new Thunder, not us. A little disappointing. I'm sure you guys might have been like, oh my gosh, he won he won Coach of the Year. But no, they went 69 and 13 without or with the new Westbrook and all those people. So we have new Westbrook or normal Westbrook, old Kevin Durant on the first team. And uh, no one, it's looking like we don't have anyone else on the teams. But let's go to the statistics. League leaders, player stats. So we're going to go to the player stats. We have Kevin Durant, Westbrook, Harden, Whiteside, Covington. Exactly what we want to see. Covington did a lot better than what I thought. I thought Sarge would be up here. But that's okay. Covington came off the bench, had 10 points. Um, how many boards did we have? Who led? Whiteside, okay. It's exactly what I thought. Blocks, 1.8. And Durant, 1.3. Pretty good there. Not too bad. I really thought Westbrook would be a little bit higher. But I guess he's only a 91 overall here. And Durant is a 97. But let's go to the rookie report to see if anything crazy happened. Nothing crazy in rookie report. League leaders, anything crazy. Curry averaged 31 points per game. That's really high. And also Westbrook had 20. He almost had the triple-double, right? Um, anything else to look at? Let's go to the team stats. And we did not finish with 55 wins. I did not mention that. The Thunders finished 69. And we came four spots below them. We didn't finish. Or no, we did finish top five. We came right at the fifth spot. Um, hopefully, we don't have to play any of these crazy teams up here. Maybe they'll get cut out of the playoffs really fast. But let's go to the playoffs. Where are, where are we first game? So our first game's right here against the Clippers. Fourth against the Fisty. I'm not too worried about it. We're going to send the entire thing. And 3-2. Oh, I did not stop it fast enough. We almost lost that. 4-3. We came back 3-3. Game, Force game 7. Now it is the new OKC Thunder against the old OKC Thunder. 2011-2012, that's us. We went 49-33 against the top overall team in the league. But now we have our, we have that little trick up our sleeves that we like to do. Go to the coaching game plan. Go to our rotations. And let's make it a eight-man rotation. We, we can't risk anything. So we have to give a lot of minutes to a lot of different people. Um, Willie Reed, do I want him as the eighth man or do I want Ellis? I think I want Ellis here. So we can go Ellis up there. Willie Reed, you're cold and Ellis is hot. So we're going to switch the minutes. Um, our team's looking really good. Zar Dario Saric is up to an 80 overall. That's really cool. So now we have an all 80 overall team and Covington off the bench. So 37 minutes up and above for all our starters. We're going to go to the game. Simmy game by game. This is our only competition, I think. We lose game one. We lose game two. Tell me we're not going to lose to our own team in the future. We get Okay, we get, we get a game. Can you force a game four? Nope. 3-1. We're going to lose this, aren't we? Simulate game. Okay, we come back. Let's force game six. Uh, the 2011-2012 Oklahoma City Thunder have been eliminated. So we lose the challenge. We made it to the second round of the playoffs, only to lose to our future selves in the 2018 season. Hopefully they can win the championship. Just Okay, there we go. They won the championship. It makes things makes us feel a little bit better, you know? Uh, as long as we lost to the like, better team. Paul George averaged 34 points in the into the finals. Let's see what their stats were, honestly. Like... Uh, roster. Let's go find the Thunder. Probably right next to us, right? Yeah, so they had they had Westbrook, Paul George, Carmelo Anthony, Steven Adams, Andre Roberson is a 78 overall, Patterson's a 77, he's a 76, he's a 76. These stats are really, really kind of messed up, honestly. Like, these people shouldn't be that high. Patterson and Abrinas. Abrinas for sure shouldn't be a 76 overall, but you know, it's okay. We lost. Nothing we can do now. It's over. So we lost the challenge. Let's see if we can know. Okay, so that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later.